Tonight, local 10 cameras rolling as a South Florida teacher walks out of jail. He's accused of using force to break up a play fight, leaving a student with a fractured arm. Local 10's Terrell Forney is live in West Miami Dade with the details. Terrell. And the teacher is spending the night here at TGK following this incident inside of a classroom. That student first ended up on the floor and then later in the hospital. Joel Encilo shielded his face and was short on words as he walked out of jail Tuesday night following his arrest on aggravated child abuse charges. He grabs the victim by the arm, tosses him, and the victim ends up fracturing his arm. Earlier in the day, the 30-year-old was in court answering to a judge on the accusations involving a 12-year-old student. And CeeLo was a teacher at Kip Miami, a public charter school, part of a nonprofit group of college preparatory schools for early education. He's since been fired after that 12 year old boy was rushed to the hospital with that injury. In court, attorneys debated over the intent of the student's injury. He obviously touched the child too hard, which resulted in the injuries. Sometimes just kids fall the wrong way too, Judge. It's culpable negligence, I agree. In a statement, Kip Miami acknowledges the incident and says in part, we are deeply saddened to confirm that a student was injured on campus. Our faculty worked swiftly to ensure medical attention was received. An investigation has been launched and we are fully cooperating with authorities. It goes on to say Encilo was removed and is no longer employed there. You know, it's harassment, right? No word from Encilo himself on what actually happened. So that now former teacher bonded out on a $10,000 bond online. He listed himself as the language arts teacher who later became the dean of culture. Reporting live from West Miami Day tonight, Terrell Fournay, Local 10.